Nigeria on Monday recorded its highest daily COVID-19 cases as the world continues to battle the virus and reactions continue to trail the latest figures among Nigerians. Jacinta Obioku reports. Since early December 2020, there has been a spike in coronavirus cases in Nigeria as the country continues to record relatively high daily infections. A few days ago, the Nigerian Center for Disease Control, NCDC, reported 1,204 new coronavirus infections. Before then, the highest figure was the 1,145 cases recorded on December 17, 2020. On a breakfast show, we had a public health researcher discuss the federal government's position that there is no plan to impose second lockdown, the implications while considering the possible hunger. I can understand the reluctance in instituting another lockdown in Nigeria. The first lockdown, if you look at it holistically, came with its own challenges. So um, economic implications and financial implications. We, we are not in no way ready for a second lockdown, whether the citizens um, or the government. And the reasons are obvious. Uh, we don't have a proper database for uh, indigent persons in Nigeria. And uh, I think it was one of the um, difficulties of, um, of the first um, lockdown in the sense that those who are really in need could not be reached in time. Nigerians have also reacted to the daily spike of the virus. As you can see me with, uh, with my face mask, that means I don't want another lockdown. The COVID-19 stuff is true. So it's just for us to be careful. We also spoke to the NCDC official to find out how they arrived at a figure since there is no lockdown. Lockdown entity is different from how we track and get cases and deal with them and report them. That will not disturb how um, cases are captured, for instance. Cases are captured when people show symptoms and the call of session of the air personnel, either through uh, the airline or the go to any facility and the air care workers who are aware and the suspect case either because the person is showing classical symptoms or is showing symptoms and they get history of somebody who is positive with um, the contact uh, to that person. On the rumor that the more the number increases, the more aid NCDC gets from international communities, this is what he has to say. No international community has any money to give anybody now. Everybody is affected by this uh, global pandemic. Recall that NCDC warned in December that there will be a spike based on carelessness of many during festive period. It's still a call for all to take the observance of the protocols seriously. Jacinta Ubuku for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.